Meanwhile, some residents here in the Midlands went overseas to offer a helping hand to the refugees. Nigel Hood shares more about an experience one first responder says he will never forget. And, uh, we had two cruise missiles uh, that were launched in the Black Sea come across our heads and about a second or two later they exploded. It was a day that shook the world when Russian forces raged war on Ukraine. A firefighter at the North Airfield in Orangeburg County was on the front lines helping Ukrainian refugees. I had no point of contact. I had no clue who I was supposed to go see, what direction I needed to go. I basically grabbed the gear that I could um, and packed my bags, bought a plane ticket, and I left. Alacron served six years in the Marine Corps and over the years was deployed to Iraq and Afghanistan. He says he used his combat experience to offer medical assistance and protection to some of the millions of refugees who fled the country to safety. He also handled casualty evacuations on the battlefield. I mean, that's what I do as, uh, as my career. I'm a first responder, you know, while everybody's running away from the fire, you know, we run in. Seeing the destruction that uh, 20 minutes worth of shelling can do to a village is uh, nerve wracking. Seeing the damage of the buildings, the uh, infrastructures, the roads. He says a year later, the work continues. The war's not over yet. There's still plenty of things that they need, a lot of help, and if I could, if I could possibly make it back there by tomorrow, I'll be there in a heartbeat. For Street Squad Orangeburg, Nigel Hood, News 19, WLTX.